Hello, you're welcome. How to solve for x in this night exponential equation? What we are given here, we can divide through by 16 raised to the power x, and this becomes 25 raised to the power x divided by 16 raised to the power x, then minus 20 raised to the power x divided by 16 raised to the power x equals to 16 raised to the power x divided by 16 raised to the power x and from here this cancel each other and this here we have one left then from what we have here applying the law of indices a raised to the power n over b raised to the power n same as a over b 4 raised to the power n and when we apply this from what we have here and this can be written as 25 over 16 4 raised to the power x minus 20 over 16 4 raised to the power x now equals to 1 on this side then 25 same thing as 5 squared and 16 same thing as 4 squared then all raised to the power x minus here we can write 20 that's 4 times 5 then divided by 16 as 4 times 4 then all raised to the power x now equals to 1 then here 4 we cancel out here then also applying the law of indices here this power of 2 here, we can take it out and this becomes 5 over 4, 4 squared, then all raised to the power x minus, here we have 5 over 4 left, all raised to the power x, now equals to 1. Then, on the law of indices, what we have a raised to the power n raised to the power n this same thing as a raised to the power m n which also same thing as a raised to the power n raised to the power m that is from here we can interchange this power here and this becomes 5 over 4 all raised to the power x then all squared then minus 5 over 4 all raised to the power x now equals to 1 then from here we can let a letter represent 5 over 4 raised to the power x so we have 5 over 4 all raised to the power x here let it be equal to a letter u and from here this becomes u squared minus u equals to 1 which we can bring one here and this we have u square minus u minus one equals to zero then applying the quadratic formula u equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a where a here is equals to one B here is minus 1, then C here is minus 1. Then this formula becomes U equals to minus minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 squared, then minus 4 times 1, times minus 1, then over 2 times 1. That this here, this becomes u equals to 1 plus or minus square root of here, 1 plus 4, then over 2. That is from here, we have u to be equals to 1 plus or minus root 5 over 2. So we have two possible values of u here. The first one we have u equals to 1 plus 
root 5 over 2 and here we have u equals to 1 minus root 5 over 2. Then here we recall that we represented u as 5 over 4 all raised to power x. Then which implies that here we have 5 over 4 all raised to power x is now equals to 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then also this side we also have 5 over 4 all raised to power x equals to 1 minus root 5 over 2. Now on this side the result here will be positive and also here is positive. So here positive and here is negative. So hence there is no real solution on this side. Then on this side here we can solve further taking the log on both sides and here we have log 5 over 4 all raised to power x equals to here we have log into bracket 1 plus root 5 over 2 then here we apply the power log logarithm when we have log m raised to power p the same thing as p log n then from here the power here is x so this becomes x log 5 over 4 then equals to here we have log into bracket 1 plus root 5 over 2 that is from here let's divide both side by log 5 over 4 so divide this side as well by log 5 over 4 that is here this cancel each other and here we have x left which is equal to on this side we can apply the law of logarithm log a over b same thing as log a minus log b now from here it implies that what we have here can be written as log 1 plus root 5 then minus log 2 of there then divided by also what we have here applying that we have log 5 minus log 4 and of course here log 4 because 4 is also written as 2 square then from the power law this can be written as log 2 square now that is here we have x now equals to log into bracket 1 plus root 5 then minus log 2 then over here we have log 5 minus 2 log 2 and also here we can put this in a decimal and from here this will be approximately equals to 2.15643 and uh, which also when we check by substituting this into what is given which is 25 raised to power x minus 20 raised to power x equals to 16 raised to power x here when we substitute we have 25 raised to power 2.15643 then minus 20 raised to power 2.15643 and is equal to 16 raised to power 2.15643 now when we check on this side, this gives us 394.926 Then we 
see here. Then here, this fee was 395.003. That is here. What is on the left here is approximately equal to 395. And also, this side is approximately equal to 395. So, left hand side now equals to the right hand side. And hence, we can conclude that the value of x for this given problem will be approximately equal to 2.15. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel and turn the notification bell on for more exciting videos. See you next class and bye for now.